to give your customer a credit, go to day to day, money in, and customer adjustment notes. You enter a customer adjustment note in the same manner you enter an invoice. Click on add. Select the customer and complete the form in the normal manner. Complete header details and then in the table, enter the details for which the credit is being given. Enter an item. If the credit is non-specific, then you may need a separate item for it. Enter a description, a quantity if needed, and for the tax code, the same tax code you used on the original invoice, like GST. You can add more entries onto the form, click on Add New Row, and complete the details. When finished, check your entries and return to the top. You can use this adjustment note in a number of ways. If you will be giving your customer a cash refund, then click on Approve. Click Cancel to the screen Application of Credit. Click on Issue Refund. The adjustment note will save and a payment section at the bottom will open. Select your bank account, check the amount and if needed enter a reference. If this customer has unpaid invoices, then you'll see the line Apply Available Transactions. You can change your mind and apply the adjustment note to outstanding invoices. Tick the box, select the invoice and the amount to apply. Click Save to process the refund. You'll see the entry already paid at the bottom of the total section and a balance due, in this case of 0.00. .00. Click Close and back on the Customer Adjustment Notes page, you'll see this transaction under the Close tab. You can also choose to save the refund and apply it to an invoice at a later time. Just click on Approve and on the Application of Credit screen, choose Store as Credit. Click OK and Close. This transaction will appear in the Approve tab. If you later wish to pay out this adjustment note, open it and click on Issue Refund. To apply this customer credit, open an invoice and click on Receive Payment. In the Receive Payment area at the bottom of the screen, tick the option Apply Available Transactions. Now select the adjustment note to apply and if the full amount is not being applied, the amount to use. Click Save. You'll come back to the invoice view and you will see that the already paid amount has been updated with the adjustment note amount. You can now go ahead and complete the payment of this invoice. Thanks for watching this video and if you have any further questions please go to reckon.com forward slash support.